How's it going everyone? Hopefully doing well. Welcome to T125. Now, this thing is kind of like the super conqueror for the American heavy tanks. Apart from the fact that it's not as good hold down as the super conqueror is. Although, if you can hide that capola, it pretty much is. We're going to be playing with two different setups. We are going to be using uh, HP boost, rammer and vents. And then we'll switch it up and we'll be also using turbo, vents and a rammer. Um, I don't really think this needs a V stat, I'll be honest. Um, it gets pretty decent uh, soft stats for the stabilization, so I don't really see it. I would much rather put either vents in there or you could go turbo and HP, um, but vents does help this thing out quite a bit um, to kind of match that DPM of the Super Conk. But without further ado, Let's go and get straight into some games. Okay, straight away, this is a HP map. I'm not going to put turbo on this because we'll get there well, around about the same time as everyone else anyway. Um, so I'm not really too fussed about that. And I feel like the turbo is going to help out in those maps where you need to get there first. Whereas with this, HP is going to help us out tremendously. Um, you know, we're now at 2,470 hit points. We don't have the full field pods on this, um, but they... I mean, it doesn't really... Okay, as this guy gets some air. Um, it doesn't really matter too much. Um, it is a tier 9 game, so we do have that going for us. And what we're going to do is try and see if we can shoot someone early on as they're crossing to get into the bunker um, from up here. Usually there's one person. There he is. But that guy having a nice 418 damage. Lovely. Is there anyone else? Doesn't look like it. Okay, well, let's now go and turn our attention over to the people that are over here. I'm going to load heat now because we're going to be needing it. And first shot into the Chief Capola. We could actually, to be fair, pretty much like free play against this Chief, I'm pretty certain. Like we can we can hide Acapola pretty well against the chief from here, um, and he has a very very small shot to actually hit us with. But like we also don't really have much to go on to shoot him either. So uh, I accidentally misclicked, but it's fine. It's fine. I have been recording for the last like I don't know three hours. Okay. I'm a little bit all over the place at the moment. Uh, try, but that's not really going to pen. I believe that we're just going to have to sit here and wait. Honestly, like that's going to be our game. We just sit here and just do nothing for a little bit. There is no, uh, no real way of progressing this battle at the moment. I mean, the good news is that if anyone comes up to this bit here, like they try and come round to my side, I can shoot them from here, so that's good. Chieftain's going down. Ah, is the chief coming up here? Hello, friend. As we find out. Would have been nice to get that second shot off. See if we can get one into this guy as he's crossing. Not quite. Poor E75. He's just trying his best. Hmm. Don't have a clean shot on that. Uh, if he goes back though. Have a nice shot on that. That's an easy shot be able to shoot again in a second. Okay, his turret actually just blocked that shell. Like, and that turret landing there is one of the most like unlucky unlucky places for it to land. Because it actually protects them pretty well. Like indirectly. Alright, let's get one to the chief. Block 
the cupola, it's not going to matter. I mean, we can try and hide like this. Wow. This chief isn't really that good. What? Come on, that's a... That should be a pen. Of course. Of course it amoracks me. Like, why, why wouldn't amorack me? I mean, I guess the benefit is that they don't know that I'm amoracked at the moment. That was an awful shot. Oh, they just get so lucky that I get Amorak there. Otherwise, we could have actually done something. That was that was some stupid RNG. I'm not going to lie. That was some really, really dumb RNG. Like, that shot on the E75 should have penned, like, 100% of the time. We're above him, shooting down onto his forehead. I want to know where that shot went. So was it this shot or this shot that done... No, it was, it was this shot that done the Amorak, right? I think. Or was it this one? I don't know. Either way, it's stupid. Um, where's the one? Of course. Like, you know, we aim up here and it goes low. Because why wouldn't it? And we also aim here and it goes wide. What? I mean, we won, so whatever. But 3.5k is not really very good. We would have easily got over 4k if we hadn't got amorak actually. Because we would have got out at least two, maybe three shots more. Um, but, yeah, the Amorak really screwed us over. Oh, well, into the next game. And again, Himmelsdorf. This is a HP boost map, not a turbo. We don't need turbo for this. Um, because pretty much getting there anyway, like, it's not really going to make much difference. So, uh, as always, to the banana line. Now, unfortunately, because we're on this side, it is going to be a little bit annoying to deal with the Capola. Um, well, okay. It's also going to be annoying to deal with an E3. Did he just fire? That was E3, right? Come on! That was fully aimed as well. Like, fully aimed at the bottom. And again, this is why E3s are just dumb. Because they, they're so... It's not that he's outplaying me. It's that RNG is outplaying me. need this to go down. Like, I haven't actually gone... None of my shots have actually gone where I've aimed them yet. There we go. Finally. This E3 is still on... Oh, no, he's not on full health. Uh, ah. I mean, I'm going to get very annoyed at this gun soon. This gun is not hitting anything at the moment. I actually pressed the wrong button. I meant to go backwards when I went forwards. Well, I can't really even play here, so I'm going to push forwards. The E3 just shot. I need to try and get across. E3's got about two seconds left of his reload. Need to kill that E3. To be honest. 450 roll. Not very good, but... E3 fired. Very good. I'm 
nice. Put one into the i7 as well. Another one into the i7. Just hide now. Hopefully I can kill this FV now. I know I'm firing heat, but I really just don't care at this stage, to be honest. That's another E3, which is just amazing to try and deal with. I love fighting against E3s, actually. That, how this gun is not behaving? Like, I, 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 it's so annoying, actually. And then that one hits. Like, what? Okay, well that's just like one of the luckiest shots I've ever seen someone hit. <sighs> I need to back off now. Thought the Leo would be trying to come this way, but he's not at the moment. I need to run. Like pretty much all the way back. I don't know, like, why the uh, E3 didn't shoot me there. But, I mean, don't really care for the reason why. I'm just glad he didn't. Hmm. I mean, I'm feeling like the Leo is going to be pushing this way. We should have vision for this, I think. He's used his repair kit. At least we can keep that on, on tabs. And now he's dead. Or at least he should be. There we go. Okay, now we can try and deal with this E3. The E3's backing off. I'm going to go up high, as it might be a... a uh, harder shot for this E3 and I can also then uh, overmatch him or well, not overmatch him but I can shoot his roof and he can't see my Capola which is really really good I don't care about this VZ I care about this E3 the VZ I can kill the E3 I it's like just an RNG machine where did that VZ go he's gone into the buildings Try and get away. Uh, I don't think the VZ hasn't run because I would see him cross here. Yeah, he's, so he's still there. The same with this E3. This E3 can't escape without me, um, without me spotting him. But he can't go that way, and he can't go that way without getting spotted. Good. Okay, well, now we can go back to normal rounds because pretty much everyone I can shoot at, I can pen with AP. What I want to do is try and cross this. Go up here and then see if I can get a shot down onto this VZ. Very good. Very, very good. Now just be careful of the manticore, but I don't know where the manticore's gone. Oh, okay, he's gone over that way for whatever reason. Imagine if I hit that. <laughs> uh. Okay, HE time for the Manticore. 700 uh, hit points left on the Manticore, let's go. Let's go and try and kill him. I mean, we have 6k out of this, though. Like... E5 is god tier when you can actually get to play it. Which side are you, Mr. Manticore?
Can I not actually pin the manticore with HE? It's interesting. It's my HE pin. 60. Manticore really has that much armor? Well, I did not know. Manticore actually has enough armor. What? Okay. Well, I guess I should have just shot AP. I didn't think the Manticore had that much armor on the, uh, the hull. Nice. 6.5k. Get Mastery Badge as well, which is good. Um, I mean, we can apply it. Okay, let's go and play our third and final game. And I think we'll use Turbo regardless now, just to show it off, because we've played two games with HP. Um, so yeah, we'll do that. Okay, so, Erlenberg with the Turbo. Let's see what we can do. Obviously, we're going to go to our favourite spot on the map from this side, which is the little window where we can see people crossing. So I'll see you once we get there. And we just slalom our way through here, like so. And we just get ready to shoot this corner bit. Yes, yeah, say hello to TVP as well. He's over there, chilling. 7058, bonjour. I mean, the only problem with this position is, uh... Critical hit. Oh, come on! How does the gun do that, man? There we go. Now you're tracked. Now you can just sit there for a little bit. I'm really not enjoying how I can't pen this guy. I mean, I should just fire heat, to be honest. We didn't even scratch them. Just stop, like, cheaping out. Penetration. Just go for the damage. Don't bother trying to track this guy. The heat is free, uh, 340 heat, so... You can pretty much go through nearly everything. Get the Capola. Bounced, unfortunately. All right. Well, I don't want to fight fight you anymore. Wait, hang on. I'm gonna put one into this guy as he's crossing. And now we can try and deal with this. I'm not too sure what this guy's doing, to be quite honest with you. Like he's uh, oh, whoa, 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 wait, what is this? Oh man! I don't know. Like, what am I meant to do? Like, what? Why, why do I have a full health IS-4 that just allowed them to come around the corner? Wait, I haven't... Hang on. Was that a... Uh, that was an STLV that was in the city as well. I don't, uh, I don't know. I, I, I really don't understand how this platoon was just allowed to push that. Without any, like, they were full health when they pushed me, pretty much. I don't get it. We penned not that many of our shells, to be fair. Um, like, some of these really should have penned. Um, like, the E100 shells. Like, this one goes high when I, re I really wanted to go, you know, straight for the track. Um, which is just unlucky, to be fair, but... I mean, this one... And then we have, the, like, what? Like, come on. Like, that's, that is actually pathetic. I'm aiming for this, and it goes under. 
And then this one where it just goes too high. It's like, I just... I mean, E5 is a monster. It really is. Um, we get 4.6 out of it. Realistically, we could have got more than that. Um, if we got a normal game. Like, <laughs> we had one Himmelsdorf game, which was normal. Um, and then, you know, we had the last game, which really wasn't. Um, and then the first game of Berlin, which wasn't as well. We get unlucky because we get Amaract, but yeah. I don't know. It's a, uh, it is a beast, but it's not, you know, without its faults. you got to keep that uh, Coppola hidden, and as long as you do that, you'll be fine. Practice the gun blocking. I am not very good at gun blocking, I'm not going to lie. Um, like, I can't really do it very well, but eventually you learn it. So, uh, yeah, that is the E5. So as always, thank you very much for watching. Hope you did enjoy. If you did, then you know what to do. Make sure you leave your thoughts down below on the E5. And I'll see you all in the next one.